a cup of tea and this intro is just going to be really quick. I just wanted to say sorry again. I haven't been posting content recently. Over the past five months, I just haven't been in the greatest headspace mentally, but I feel like I'm finally getting over that not so great mental space and I'm ready to start creating content again. I know I've talked about this before, but I want my content to be a little bit different than it has been. And the different I'm talking about now is the same different I've always been talking about. And I feel like I finally got this different style figured out and I'm finally implementing it. I just I just wanted to feel like we're hanging out and like you're getting to know me and I want it to be really visually appealing. I'm thinking almost like a video diary. I don't know if that's quite the right words for it and to help me kind of want to start creating this content, I actually bought a new camera and a new lens. As you guys know, when you buy new things, you want to start using them and I feel like already I'm so excited to start creating content because things just look so much better on this lens and this camera that I got. So this video is going to be the start of kind of my new style I keep talking about. Again, I think I'm going to call it some type of diary. I'm not for sure on the name yet. It might change as it goes along. But before we jump into that, I just want to do a quick unboxing of my new camera. You guys can see what I'm working with and kind of what to expect. <laughs> So this is the Sony camcorder. Basically, it's your parents' camcorder on crack. It has that classic flip-out screen and shoots in 4K, which is actually one of the main reasons I got it. It also has a collapsible eyepiece viewfinder, so if you don't want to use the flip screen. Then on the top is the zoom button, and the zoom on this thing is seriously insane. Look at that. It's crazy. It also has a place to add a microphone here on the top, but the built-in mic on this is actually really good quality. And I don't know if you can tell, but this thing is small. Like it fits perfectly in just one hand. The lens screen opens and closes when you open the viewfinder, so you don't have to worry about like losing a cap. And it even has a built-in stabilizer, so the video quality on this is super smooth. I've had my eye on this camcorder for a while now, but at 1100 it was just a little bit too much. But I found a brand new one on OfferUp for only $700, and honestly, it was such a good decision. I love the nostalgia of a camcorder, and then you mix it with the 4K quality, the built-in stabilizer, and the zoom lens. Seriously, I love it. So as you saw, I was driving by this dumpster in my van and as soon as I started digging through it, there was a guy up in the window who you heard me talking to. He was the one that was throwing everything in that dumpster. So he owns those apartments and what had happened is the tenant who lived there had passed away. He didn't die in the apartment, but he was an older guy. He'd lived there for many years and he was a hoarder. So the guy who owned the apartment had to go in and he was cleaning everything out and he was just throwing everything away because everything was really dirty and there was just a lot of it. And so he was like, you can come up here and look through it before I throw it in there. And this guy had so much stuff. I filled up my whole van with stuff that this guy was going to throw away. And well, here's all the vintage stuff I got from some dead guy's apartment.
Appalachian sunrise meets my skin. Even with my eyes still closed, I can feel it coming in. Golden, golden, I'll follow only golden.
this guy would make it in the hole. <laughs> yeah.